We start tonight with breaking news. A massive explosion at a Stockton apartment complex. Thank you for joining us on this Friday. I'm Laura Painter. And I'm Chris Thomas. Several people are now in the hospital tonight and dozens of families are displaced. We spoke to witnesses about the scary moments. I was watching TV and I and I thought that someone threw a bomb through my slider door and then I jumped up and and, and I just grabbed my ID and ran down the hallway. Eva Fitzsimmons is one of dozens of residents now displaced after an explosion at this apartment complex on Inglewood Avenue. I didn't take time to do too much. I just, someone heard me and they were saying, get out, get out. So. I did. But for others, including one frightened grandmother, escaping proved to be a challenge. And she was, you know, really panicky. She was trying to get out, but she wasn't able to get through the front door because of um, the doors were stuck due to um, the explosion. It just, it knocked everything off as well as the locks on the doors. Jacqueline Armenta tells us thankfully her grandmother did make it out safely, but it all made for a terrifying Friday night. Um, I was like scared and um, I was with my kids and so I had to leave them with my cousin and to come over here to get my grandmother to make sure she was safe. The cause of the explosion is still under investigation, but ABC 10 was there as PG&E arrived to turn off power to the affected buildings. We're told at least three people were taken to the hospital with injuries as many count their blessings that things were not worse. Because with that blast, it could, it could killed a lot of people. The displaced are now being taken to an area library, many with only the clothes on their back, still traumatized by the explosion and extensive damage. It's so, it's so strong, you know. The blast is so strong. Everything in my apartment, like the ceiling fan, the, everything on the wall. Now gone, with still more questions than answers. What caused this explosion? Police tell me investigators will return at daybreak to search for more clues. Be sure to download the free ABC 10 app for the latest updates on this breaking news story.